Hey guys, welcome to video three of lesson 13 in module three. Whoa, that's a lot of threes. And here we have a problem that's number two in your book. So please make sure you follow along and write your notes. Tyler has five lemons. This is one fourth the number of lemons he needs to make a pitcher of a lemonade. How many lemons does Tyler need to make a pitcher of lemonade? Okay, before we go any further, let's talk about pitcher. There's a pitcher and here's a picture, right? You could They sound the same, don't they? Picture, 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 kind of the same, but these are photographs, images, and these are things you pour juice or liquids out of. And this is spelled P-I-T-C-H-E-R, P-I-T-C-H-E-R, and this is spelled P-I-C-T-U-R-E, okay? So they are two different words, and we're talking about pictures right now because he has lemonade. Got that clear? All right, very good. And what can we draw? Well, he has five lemons. Lucky Tyler, he has a good lemon tree outside his house, and he has five lemons. So we have one box with five lemons in. Let's start there. All right. This is one fourth the number of lemons he needs to make a pitcher of lemonade. So like we did in our last one, let's draw a number line. And this is one fourth, right? One fourth. Excellent. So five is one fourth of the number of lemons he needs to make a pitcher of lemonade. Okay, so how many lemons does he need to make a pitcher if this is one fourth? Okay, so let's continue with our um, number line. If that's one fourth, then we need all the way to four fourths to show a complete one pitcher, right? Um, usually we have units of one whole number at least, and that is four fourths or one whole, right? Okay, so if we're gonna have a fraction, it has to be part of a whole, at least one. Okay, so let's add to our tape diagram. See if I can do that very skillfully, not really, but there we go, okay? And we're gonna make that into parts as well. So five is one fourth, and there's two fourths, three-fourths, and four-fourths. All right, so how many lemons does Tyler need to make a pitcher of lemonade? We could be thinking about multiplication, right? And we could also be thinking about division. So let's think about what we've been talking about with division lately, and we're asking ourselves that question. We are saying five is one-fourth, of what, right? Five is one fourth of what? That is the question that we um, are thinking about when we make this division sentence. Five is one fourth of what? And we know that a tape diagram is gonna have the same numbers in all of its boxes, right? That's a tape diagram rule. So that means 5, 10, 15, 20. 5 is 1 fourth of 20. And how many lemons does he need? Please write the sentence. He needs, you can probably write a lot faster than I can. He needs 20 lemons, yes. 20. I'm just going to write L, but please write out the word lemons right here, L-E-M-O-N-S, to make a pitcher of lemonade. Okay, awesome job. Remember on your um, must-do work, just think about this, right? Um, two different things we're asking. In the last lesson, we were working on how many halves are in four. And now we're working on four is one half of what? So just keep thinking about that. Maybe write it down. That would really help. 
four is one half of what? In fact, you could pause me and copy this down. That would be awesome. Thank you for your hard work. And I'll see you later, probably in class right now. Aloha.